um, I am not doing regular videos anymore. It takes too long, and it it really just isn't my thing. Live streams are mine. So, I'm still trying to find out if I can get Modern Warfare 3 for you guys. But right now, we're going to be playing L.A. Noir. So, here we go. And uh, if you didn't see already, we last left off and at our... Um, where the lipstick burner as homicide. Okay, we are here now, so we may have to do some things again, but that's fine. So, here we go. Size nines, above average for a lady. Selene and Jacob are obviously having problems. It speaks to motive. Crime scene evidence still weighs against it being the husband, but Jacob could give us something to go on. One of my exes drank like this, you'd be feeling the back of my hand. Call in burglary and get technical services out here. I'll talk to the neighbors. Don't take all day about it, Phelps. I'll get nasty when I'm thirsty. Burglar used a pry bar. Why did you kick the door in? You think I'm going to climb through a broken window in a $30 suit? You got another thing coming, buster. Galloway, homicide, badge number 564. Requesting technical services for a suspected 459 at 142 North Union. Tiffany? The rest of the stuff is junk. Might explain the missing ring. A regular Amelia Earhart in her day. The ring looks distinctive. LAPD, are you acquainted with Celine Henry, Miss... Horgan! Jennifer Horgan. I've known Celine for more than ten years. Our children grew up together. W what's going on, officer? Did you see Mrs. Henry go out last night? Well, I'm no busybody, you understand, but... Celine had been drinking. And she and poor, long-suffering Jacob had a terrible row. I think Jacob may have given her a black eye. He stormed out and she went back inside. Did he come back? No. Celine was listening to music and shouting until she left around 10 p.m. 
She was very drunk to have been driving. But she is not the sort of person you can stop from doing something when her dander is up. What is this about, officer? Is Celine all right? I'm afraid Mrs. Henry has been murdered, ma'am. Murdered? Oh, my God. I'm afraid I need to go and, and sit down. Let's see what Jacob has to say for himself. I don't think Jacob is our man, but we should see what he has to say. Jacob Henry had a violent argument with his wife last night. He's looking more and more likely. Uh, for my money, if the broad keeps the house looking like that, she probably deserved it. The skipper says bring him in and keep the hacks off our backs for a while. Fine by me. So it ain't the werewolf killer after all. Good to see you've come to your senses, Cole. I always said work the evidence. I only stipulated a connection to the BD killer as an avenue of investigation we should leave open. And as far as I'm concerned, it still is. Follow my lead. You Jacob Henry? Yeah. Who's asking? LAPD. You're under arrest for the murder of your wife, Celine Henry. Murder? Celine? Save the dramatics oh, oh my for God. RKO, pal. You got bigger problems. What the hell are you talking about? You come in here, you tell me that Celine is... Take a seat, Mr. Henry. She's... We're going to have a look around, I... then we'll talk. Jesus, I'm sorry. I get even the slightest hint that you're a flight risk, pal. Thick in here. Let's see you try to gas the oldest problem there is what to do about the old lady. He'll be back any moment. Just sit tight. Not everything here is going to be relevant. Size 11s. So who could have killed Celine? Where did she go last night, Jacob? A 
bar, I suppose. Look, I don't know. You know where she went, Jacob. You're lying. Why would I help you if you keep lying to me? Look, I'm telling you, I don't know. He calls me if things are getting out of hand, and I go, and I bring her home. He called me last night, and I said no. Phone rang a couple more times after that. I ignored it. I'm going to have to live with that. When did you last see your wife, Mr. Henry? Last night. I went to see her. We talked. Things got a little out of hand. I left. You don't remember what time you last saw your wife alive? Look, I'm sorry. I left. Maybe 9 p.m. Might have been a little later, but... Right around nine. Why did you kill her, Jacob? Things will go better if you come clean about it. That's a lousy thing to say. I never gave up on my wife. I don't believe you, Jacob. I think you didn't have the guts to do it yourself, so you had someone else do it. You want to back that up with something, Big Mouth? Huh? The note by the phone suggests you meant her harm. You want the truth? Truth is, I was sick to death of her. I was trying to have her committed. We're still going to need you to come downtown, Mr. Henry. We can get this all down on paper, Jacob. How you got fed up with your wife and how you figured killing her would bury all your troubles. Kill my own wife? She was a loss in a trap and you just couldn't stand it anymore. Shut your goddamn mouth. <laughs> so now you're going to tell me you loved her? Ah, the DA goes all gooey over remorse, Jacob. <laughs> okay. You're awful hot under the collar for an innocent man, Mr. Henry. this bunkum. Call it in and get a squad car dispatched. And check for messages. I'll keep old Slugger here company. Operator, give me dispatch. Putting you through now. Phelps, 1247. I need a patrol unit to transport a suspect back to Central. Certainly, Detective. Any messages for me? Yes, Detective. In regards to the Celine Henry homicide, the owner of the Turkey Bowl restaurant at 1535 West 3rd Street says the victim was at his restaurant last night. Turkey Bowl restaurant. We'll check it out. You have a message from the coroner. Do you wish to be put through? Yes, ma'am. Carruthers. It's Phelps. I've completed the autopsy. Several wounds to the head from a blunt metal instrument. Closest match would be a socket wrench handle. So the cause of death was the blunt... 
No, the blows to the head surprisingly were not fatal. Death was from hemorrhage and shock from the fractured ribs and multiple injuries caused by the stomping. Anything else? He's some kind of sex fiend. The tissues of the anus were bruised about one-eighth of an inch, but no trace of semen in the anus, vagina, or stomach. Thanks, Doc. By the way, viewer discretion is advised technically. Carruthers said she took a real pounding. Maybe if he had a bit. Slow and steady, come on! Maybe if he had been a little firmer in the beginning, he wouldn't be in this situation now. I imagine that Neanderthal routine is a big hit with the ladies, Galloway. Women breathe, they'll breathe, damn it! Women love me, Phelps. I have no complexity. They know exactly what they're going to get. That cherry pie LAPD, Phelps and Galloway. We're working a murder case. Mrs. Celine Henry, you called in? Yeah, the name's Jonesco. This is my place. You saw Mrs. Henry in here last night? Until about 1 a.m., having dinner with a friend. Doing more drinking than eating. You got that straight. Mrs. Henry was seen leaving another establishment in the company of a man. Did the two of them come here? Yeah. I remember seeing her with a guy. Did you see them leave? They got into his old Pontiac. Dull brown color. I got a look at the license plate. 2B8899. Had you ever seen that man before, Mr. Nesco? A couple times, maybe. You know how it is. A lot of different faces go through an all-night place like this. We'll be in touch, Mr. Nesco. Thanks for your time. Five-star goddamn wedding. I can't decide between the tuna fish and the chicken. I love these waitresses. Everyone's a dog. The only reason some people get lost in thought is because it's unfamiliar territory. Boy, that steak had seen better days. What do you think? We should check in with R&I. Put an APB out on that plate. Hey. Where's that goddamn... Operator, message for KGPL. Putting you through now. Cole Phelps, batch 1247. I need a registered owner on a license plate, 2Boy8899. Yes, Detective. The plate belongs to a brown 1936 Pontiac. Registered owner is one Alonzo Mendez of 402 South Fremont Street, apartment 16. Thanks. Any other messages? One, Detective. From Captain Donnelly. He wants any and all suspects returned to Central. Interviews to be set up immediately. Got it. We're coming in. Thanks, ma'am. Where the hell is he going with that? Look, Pops, just hand over the money, okay? All right, young fellow, okay. Oh, hold your horses. I'm getting the money. I ain't afraid to drill you, you know. Hey. Yeah, careful with that trigger finger now. You look the nervous type. Hug the old bastard, Lefty. If I gotta come in there, I'm spraying lead, you old coot. LAPD, drop the weapon.
excuse me, but please tell me you guys saw that shot. about the woman. He's dull as dishwater, but I'm not with him for the conversation. Look, that's the latest thing. What's your beef with this guy, Phelps? Phelps, leave him be. with this guy, Phelps. That price is outrageous. Guys, I'm gonna leave this episode off here. Uh, so I'll see Mendes you guys later. Man.